McClatchy not taking the start. You can see that lane one is empty, but it's all about the middle of the pool here. Let's have a look at lane five and lane two. Storming finish there. Saunders takes it on 56.12. But it's lane four going well here. That's Applegate. She's got two body lengths advantage over her nearest challengers. Now then, let's have a look at her time and see how many points she's going to amass. Well, it's 905 points. That's a blistering swim, 64.92. But remember, it's all about those hard-earned points that you match against the world mark. Still leading, Goldsmith in lane four, chasing him down strongly. One lane down, Craig Rudgy from Carnegie in five. And these will be the first two to touch home. Goldsmith, 58-39, gets 764 points. And it's a real crunch of a finish, 15 to go. And it's still lane four, Beckerleg, but a fast finish by other swimmers try to threaten him, but it's going to be Beckerleg to hold the rest off. Very tight on the finish. Stephen Beckerleg takes it in 150.25. A personal best time for him. Hutchinson in lane five. And also the fastest qualifier, Emma Bird, in lane four in that green cap. He started to come through. 15 metres to go. Cracking finish lining up here now. It's lane five that's going to take it. And that's going to be Hutchinson. Bird's coming through. Locker's still in the medal positions down in nine. But on the touch, it's lane five. Hutchinson take it. 231.22 at the sharp end of the contest. 15 metres to go. And it's James of Plymouth Leander beginning to turn on the style here as he begins to distance himself away from the rest of the field. And it's James that takes it, 52.66. Davis looking good, the Welsh record holder on 28.54. Quite a scrap behind them for the silver with most of the field in touch here, but Davis absolutely storming away from the rest. Let's have a look at the time here. Davis stopping the clock on 28.40. A new Welsh record for Georgia Davis of Swansea Performance. Remember, it's that time as near to the world record that will amass the most points. And it's looking like Ullman is going to overhaul Gray literally in the last cluster of strokes here. As they come up to the wall, that's exactly what happens. Uh, Gemma Ullman wins that in 127.23 to amass 686 points. But this is a storming swim here by Ellis. Looking very, very good indeed. The 24-year-old motoring down the pool. And the rest, well, they can only admire and look on. He continues to distance himself away from his nearest challenges with every stroke. Second, he's still being held by lane five, Boylan. And let's not forget that Ellis is the British record holder with that 69.81. Let's have a look at the time here for Ellis. Well, it's 71.10, 751 points. Bennett in four, looking very good. And Marco Lochran in five, second. These two now have gone clear of the rest of the field. But here comes Bennett. Now then, is he going to make that time for consideration for a place in New Delhi? Let's have a look at the time. Oh, yes. Ryan Bennett, 159.12. A lifetime best for him, and I can tell you that is inside the mark for consideration for a place on the England team for New Delhi. Sean Harkin in lane five, trying to record a qualification time for the Welsh team, and she needs to put down 27.36, 12 100s inside a lifetime best. Look at this, they're all going for it, aren't they? Final five, it's a storming finish. Maybe lane six will snatch it, Lucy Waddle. Let's have a look at this. She does. Lucy Waddle, Stockport Metro takes it, 27.66.